Before we start this video, I'd like to acknowledge there's strong language and scenes up ahead. Viewer discretion is advised. But let's be honest here, we've all seen stuff like this, so yeah, let's get on with it. Hey, what's going on guys? Jerry Bay here and today we're back with another video. Today's video is Camp Camp, uh, episode 8, Into Town by Rooster Teeth. Now I am excited. It's been a while since I watched the Camp Camp video. I don't know if that's considered a good or a bad thing. For previous episodes, I'm going to consider that a good thing. So let, let's get back on into it. In three, two, one, let's react. What did I say? I said, what is don't do fire safety camp and political history camp in the same day unless you really want it to turn into riot control camp. Mm. Why did the bottom no. comics say get butt stuff? Well. You're not going to do anyone any good if you keep letting Max get to you like this. Take a break. I'll cover underwater basket weaving tomorrow. Take the camp mobile and get out of Dodge for a day. Reset. What should I do? How the hell should I know? Go into town and do... Whatever it is you do to blow off steam before you kill someone. That's not a bad idea. <laughs> the face he He's makes like, yeah, fire. you're right. BT dubs. Thank you. Oh, fascinating. So if you park the ship at a Lagrange point, then the combined gravitation... Neil, Nick, let's go. Hey, we're talking here. The moon landings were a hoax filmed in Area 51 orchestrated by the government as a publicity stunt designed to humiliate the Russians in the space race. No! <laughs> this is it. He's finally. That's one way to get to an, an astronaut. He used that conspiracy theory on him like every other day. Not him, David. The revolution is working. He's going bonkers. And he's going into town. Into town? To do what? We're gonna find out. To be honest, I'm quite excited to see what he'll do. I mean, this is David. I, he doesn't really have a adult-like brain, if you know what I mean. He's kind of somewhat childish. So this, this ought to give us some insight into his psyche right now. So I, I, I'm getting excited. Hopefully I don't get worried. <sighs> Sweet 22.2 degrees Celsius, here we come! You idiot, this isn't about air conditioning. This is our chance to study David. Uh, I always kind of dry out in AC, and it makes me sneeze. Hush, you! Just what exactly do you think he's into? Hookers and blow! What? what? I don't know what it is, but my dad and his friends always said they wish they could do that for fun. And then they would laugh! <laughs> Maybe that's what David likes. Look, there's no way anyone that happy can exist. <clears throat> oh, man. have a weakness, and I'm gonna find it. Welcome to the audio edition of the Farmer's Almanac for the year of our Lord, 1972. Being a oh, God. Style or leap year. Includes weather forecasts for all regions of the USA, as well as planning cables and zodiac secrets for every month. Oh, this one's gonna be good. You gotta be kidding me. He has to have a weakness. You're hurting me. How does he not hear them? Finally, back in the real world. Sweet, sweet civilization. Uh, guys, not so much. Was that a small town? What fresh hell is this? There's, there's nothing. What does anyone around here do for fun? Fun? There's been no fun here since aught nine. Something happened a few years ago? 1909, when the mayor actually outlawed fun. The great naked ankle incident of 09. Well, somebody's always got to push it too far, ruin it for everyone else. <laughs> okay. Oh, damn it. Target's in motion. Let's move out, guys. Guys? Great Scott. Neil? Neil! Neil, we gotta go! Nikki, how about... Max, I'm not feeling so great all of a sudden. Oh. 
Aww. No, we lost him. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. He's Let's just around the Neil. corner. You go be Neil in the nerd shop. Just stay here and keep an eye on the wagon. Get ready to haul ass if you see David about to leave. I'm home. Yeah, okay. All right, Nikki, let's go David hunting. Okay. <laughs> Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. What lame place did David go in? Hmm. Your eyes hurt. Why is she sick? So, He's got the AC sort of thing, or? What's for root beard he got on tap? Don't serve your kind here. Your kind? Your kind? Care to be more specific, sir? I'm calling you out. Kids. Oh, well, that's totally understandable. I'll keep it quick then. What you know about a guy named David? Runs one of them camps out on the lake. Might have just been through here. Kind of guy all the neighbors say they never saw it coming when he finally snapped. Looks like this. Him. It's so messed yeah, up. Yeah, he's a bit on edge now, isn't he? Kept saying something about how it was all some kid's fault. I know what you're thinking. You're totally right. So he come here often? Is he a sad drunk? Happy drunk? Gay drunk? Mm, don't know about any of that. Guess he did hit his Shirley Temple pretty hard. He beat a woman? David, you unbelievable bastard. I didn't know you had it in you. Where is he now? Looked like he was headed down Plain Street. Might have hopped into a Muffin Tops. He went to a bakery? Poor oh desperate my god. Is this where you go for women? <laughs> Max? Dying. Me too, Nikki. Dying to catch David in the act. Let's go. Oh, hey there, kiddo. What you doing there? How did you guys ever make this stuff work? Shooting electrons out of a cathode ray to excite phosphors? I mean, it's charming in a tin cups and strings sort of way. No Nerd! About electronics, do ya? Yeah, a little something. Hello, Lester. Hey there, Fred. Beautiful of a day out there, ain't it? Yep, beautiful of a day. Almanac says there shouldn't be any rain for... Guys, guys, I'm trying to watch here. Oh, sorry, son. What seems to be the problem there, Fred? Well, Lester, the old ham here is on the fritz again. Guys, come on. Again? Hmm, well, let me take a look. I would have thought that new capacitor should have done the... Here. <laughs> well, thanks. Well, I'll be hornswoggled. Hmm. Don't come back. Come back when you're 18. Oh my god! Was not prepared for that. Oh, okay. I can't believe you said that. A hardware store? I don't get it. Why is she all girly now? Hmm. Pigtails and bows? I. What's going on? Hmm. Ah. No. Neil, red alert! Huh? This is it! He snapped! We gotta go! But we don't close till by Tesla's coils! What? Wait! Who are you? What have you done with Nikki? Max, what did you do to her? Is she dying? She was with me the whole time as we ran around town. Need nature. Nikki, go home. <coughs> oh, oh. He's here. Wait, what is all that stuff? He's going to kill me. What? We went too far. What do you mean, we? This is all you. Yeah, but I didn't want to drive him to murder. I just wanted to show him that his entire philosophical outlook on life is flawed and that the fundamental beliefs and ideologies he holds so dearly are trivial, so he'll start crying himself to sleep like the rest of us. I'm not a monster. <laughs> Max? Uh oh. Well, <coughs> hi, David. I'm suddenly regretting multiple recent choices. Uh, this is your fault, Max. Shut up. This is fine. As soon as we get back to camp, we find Gwen and he's not taking us back to camp. All I've ever tried to do is help you. I keep trying to tell you about the joys of camping, of being part of a team, of helping your fellow campers. But no, you never try. You just push and push and push. I don't know what to say anymore. I've got nothing left. You've left me no choice. Ah! 
Are you fucking serious? <laughs> And she's back. Bastard. Your getaway from the camp is to go camping? I don't know what to tell you anymore about how cool camping can be. All I can do now is show you. The hell you think you're going? I gotta get back to work. I got a 401k, whatever that is. You're Come underaged. On, Did you know I have the Farmer's Almanac on tape? If we start now, we can finish 1973. <laughs> uh, just kill us. All right, more clever writing from Rooster Teeth. Just, <laughs> I'm sorry, man, but when they went into that club, like, <laughs> you turned the Nikki, come back when you're 18. Just, how could you say that to a kid? I'm sorry, but how? <laughs> I mean, to be honest. That's probably not bad from when they, uh, from what they saw when they were in that dungeon. <laughs> if you guys know what I'm talking about, if you don't, you can go back to the episode. I can't remember which one it was. What's what's it called? Journey to a Spooky Island. That's what it is. I don't recommend it, but if you want to, just it's right there on my playlist. <laughs> and I can kind of understand uh, David uh, <laughs> going camping to escape because I understand that camping can sometimes just be a relief just outside in the nature doing what you got to do hunt either hunting fishing or just setting up a campfire which is really fun i'd like to go camping one day uh the most i've ever done for camping is setting up a really crappy tent outside <laughs> that's pretty much it <laughs> and staying out there for like what 15 minutes and coming back inside just to watch tv and eat pizza rolls Oh, uh, good times. Good times. <laughs> and it's kind of strange, like, without nature, Nikki turns into a really sick, a lot more feminine-looking girl. I, I don't know how that works, but, get, <laughs> but I shouldn't put that much logic in a cartoon, especially a YouTube cartoon, which all logic is out the door. <laughs> I really like this episode. It's pretty fun getting to see what Dave is like. Not that different. Pretty much the same, you know, no hidden secrets whatsoever, just a guy who really likes camping. If you guys want to see the original video, I'll leave a link in the description down below, as always. If you have any reaction requests, feel free to leave it down in the comment section below. I'll try to get to it as fast as I can, and yeah, later.